Umewaita nyinyi kama viongozi kwa sababu matatizo ya lamo hayako kwa wananchi. Matatizo yako kwa viongozi. Na nyinyi kama viongozi ndio mtakaoamua kama lamu itakuwa na usalama ama lamu itaendelea kuwa na matatizo. Ni nyinyi mlioketi hapa pamoja na sisi ndio tutaamua. Vile tumefanya katika taifa letu la Kenya. Usalama ni haki ya kila mkenya. Mali ya kila mkenya, maisha ya kila mkenya, watoto wa kila mkenya, biashara zao ni jukumu letu kama serikali tukifanya kazi na viongozi tuhakikishe ya kwamba mali yao iko salama watoto wao wako salama biashara zao ziko salama hakuna mtu mgeni hapa mimi pia nimekuwa katika uwanja huu kwa muda nimekuja lamu mara nyingi hata baada ya hii uchaguzi lamu ni kati ya counties nimekuja zaidi ya counties zingine kumaanisha ya kwamba tunawadhamini na kwa hivyo hakuna mtu kiongozi ama mwananchi lamu wanaweza kusema ati serikali ya Kenya haiwajali ama haiwafikirii ama haiwadhamini we value lamu county the same way we value every other county in Kenya and that is why continuously consistently we have engaged on lamu issues Lamu development issues, Lamu security issues, mambo ya usalama ya Lamu. Sasa nyinyi mumetuchanganya kwa sababu wakati sisi tunaelekeza mipango mawazo yetu kupambana na magaidi. Pia hapa tuko na shida ya kisiasa uchochezi wa kisiasa ambayo inatuharibia usalama ya wananchi. So sasa tumechanganya, eh, tumechanganya matatizo ya ugaidi na matatizo ya uchochezi wa kisiasa ambayo inapiganisha wananchi hapa wananchi wanapigwa na magaidi alafu wananchi tena pale katikati wanapiganishwa wananchi wenyewe good people that is unacceptable that is unacceptable and my two ministers for defense and internal security have been to lamu several times you know that they have been to lamu seven all times and they have not come to lamu at kwa sababu wamekuja kwa holiday they've always come to lamu to think to work with you on how we are going to manage the security situation in lamu